friends, it's Akadiris, and welcome everybody to another episode of... Why Japan? This is a series that I do here in Japan where I go to different department stores or go online shopping for different inventions and different products that are made or manufactured in Japan. Some of the products that I bring onto this series are just for laughs, while other products just look a little different but are surprisingly useful. But a lot of the funny looking products that you may see around the internet actually does have a name that goes by Chindogu. I have two products that I'm going to show you guys in this video, so without further ado, let's go! Can any of you even guess what this is? I'll hold it up like this. So, this product I've never seen a single person wear. No, wait, I lied. Yes, I have. Okay, the person I saw wearing this was working on construction on the road, and I guess it kind of makes sense considering it was raining and they had to work. This isn't just exclusive to Japan, there's been other companies around the world who have made this. Milady. So this is an umbrella cap and it's supposed to prevent you from getting wet from the rain. Pretty self-explanatory, supposed to do the job of an umbrella without you needing to hold it in your hands. Pretty good if you have your hands full of other things as well. Though I will have to admit that it's not really staying securely on my head. Hold on, I'm just trying to... <laughs> like if I move my head a lot, it kind of wobbles around like that. Might even fall off. Oh, look at that. Oh, ow! the new summer look. Unfortunately, it's not raining right now, but I will go outside just to see how the sun hits. And I have neighbors. I'm so nervous to go out. All right, I'm doing it. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. No, I'm taking this off first. No, I can't do it. <laughs> well, it's definitely not good for lying down in hammocks. If I wanted to take a nap without the sun in my face, this would probably work. To make matters worse, I'm also wearing Crocs with this. This is just like, why? All right, the umbrella cap. I think I've used it enough to give it a full on review. Time to review the product. Was it useful? Uh, I mean, I can see the use in it, but it wasn't very secured on my head. Maybe I just have a big ass head, so I'll just take that into account. So I'll just say yes. It was useful to that other guy that I saw wear it. Does it work? It keeps the sun out of my eyes. Oh wait, we didn't even test it with water. Dry as a desert, bro. <laughs> yep, it works. Okay, was it worth the price? I paid 1,400 yen for it, which is like 12, 13 dollars. <sighs> I feel like you could just get a normal umbrella for that price, so no. It is not worth 14 dollars. And will I keep it? Now for our next victim, I mean product. Wait, what is it? The sake board. So this is sort of like a noise canceling microphone, which I've done something very similar in the past on this series. But on this one, you can also write all your frustrations onto the microphone and then shout them into here. And it's supposed to be really good if you don't want to disturb your neighbors. This is specifically marketed for you to shout all your aggression. Whereas the other one was more geared towards singing. At the end of the day though, these are kind of the same product. But I'm gonna see how this one performs. Now the packaging, it says shout, and on here it has instructions on what you should do. I've had a pretty good I don't know. Do I have any stress that I want to get out right now? I think I got something. <clears throat> oh, I'll put uh, subtitles uh, for those of you that can't understand me. In spite of everything that I've accomplished in my life, I'm actually still struggling with my own insecurities and seeking the approval of those that are closest to me. The irony that I'm a public figure and don't care about the public opinion, but do about someone that's closest to me, says a lot about the fact that I care way too much about the few people I let into my life, and when they leave my life, it hurts a lot more than it should. I know that I should probably vent this a lot more than I do, but I'm the type of person that doesn't want to hear the same repetitive everything's going to be fine, Aki. I need to be broken down, a reason as to why I feel the way I do and why everything's going to be okay. And sometimes I don't vent because I know that people are going through their own struggles, and I've always been the type to try and handle it on my own. And whenever I do find the occasional friend that's willing to listen to me, I feel good for most of the day until I have to go to bed and I'm lost again in my own thoughts. Thus putting me in a nasty repetitive cycle where I end up feeling exactly the way I did before I vented. Yeah, so I don't know, I just like really can't grow these plants, so if anyone wants to try and give me some tips, let me know. So I'm gonna write on here, but I'm gonna scream showing the blank side towards you guys, so that you guys can see if you can understand what I'm saying. And then, at the end, I'm gonna reveal what I said by showing you guys what I wrote on this side. Okay, ready? Alright, here we go. <laughs> That actually really does work. <coughs> Fuck. Here's the reveal. Have you figured out what I said? <gasps> Why haven't you bought my new YouTube figure available right now for $29.99? Why Japan? 
If I ever need to scream for no apparent reason, this will do the job. Did it work? Very noticeable difference. If I ever want to go scream at the top of my lungs, this product will do just that. Is it useful? I guess if you live in an apartment complex and you really want to scream or sing at the top of your lungs. Is it worth the price? This was 1,900 yen. So it's, it's like almost 20 bucks. Just notice this thing looks like a pencil sharpener. I wouldn't say that this is worth almost 20 bucks. I'd say if it wasn't for the video and I just wanted to go look for another YouTube prop, this would be worth like five bucks. So 18 bucks is a little much for what this is. And will I keep it? I've already answered that. This is definitely going to be a regular YouTube prop that I'll at some point use again. Maybe, maybe not, I don't know. Have one more product, my U2s. Is it useful? Does it work? That doesn't make sense. Is it worth the price? Is it worth the price? And will I keep it? And do you want it? Do you need it? Will you go into the description? You guys can enjoy little Aki here with her own Y Japan buzzer, as well as the return of Tentacle Sama that she's riding like a Bronco. Other than that, let me know what you guys thought of any of the products I've shared for this episode of Y Japan, and I appreciate you guys for watching and subscribe for more content, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!